how can we generate incomes while being sustainable in terms of the products that we produce, in terms of the jobs that we provide, in terms of the environment that we are working in, how can we make it better? TBE stands for Green Bioenergy, an innovative social business that innovates and distributes eco-friendly clean cooking goods and services. Uganda still very much depends on tree biomass for cooking, so briquettes are coming in as a really innovative replacement. We are in the midst of a climate crisis. As much as Sub-Saharan Africa contributes the least to climate change, it's the people here that are suffering the most. There is a really strong need to bring renewable energy solutions. Briquettes are new technology for many Ugandans. Green Bioenergy is really stepping in not only to manufacture these products, but to educate. There are a few simple steps into making clean charcoal briquettes. Firstly, you will collect and sort the waste from the neighborhood. Secondly, you will transform the waste into char. After that, you will prepare the starch binder. You will mix the char and the starch binder together. The result is a solid clean charcoal briquette. Some do not understand the environmental concept. The briquettes are very easy to use once you adapt to the way they work. It involves behavior change, so it needs someone to be talking to the clients and passing the message consistently. Yeah, since we, are, we just wanted to know how the briquettes are working for you. I have my neighbors there, but I've inspired them by the way I was cooking. I save more when I use them in terms of money to buy charcoal. It's 100% made from recycled waste. Customers realize 20 to 40% energy savings because of its burning time. We have direct sales. These are sales that are done from the shops. And then we have the direct sales with the borders. It's a motorcycle. You can get your product not more than 30 minutes. Then the other product, the improved cook stove, both for institutions and then the households. These improved cook stoves were also targeted to reduce emissions because of their design and as well allow cash savings. Green Bioenergy promotes the sustainable development goals, but with a big emphasis promoting clean energy, eliminating poverty, and of course promoting gender as well. Seed came in at a point where Green Bioenergy was scaling production and they provided financing, but they also provided business development support, linking us to different experts and then, of course, policy influence. They work with different stakeholders in Uganda to look at aspects of policy. Green bioenergy is a very interesting business for us because they are directly solving the challenge of a lack of access to clean cooking solutions, but at the same time building partnerships that enable job creations, but also increase distribution of products across the country. So they're among the 11 uh, businesses that we're supporting under the clean cooking sector. My ultimate ambition at Green by Energy is of course at forefront is to see my community members develop and developing means in terms of incomes and then secondly uh, in terms of skill set. Currently we are working with four women entrepreneurs. The training revolves around that record keeping, demonstration and then market activation. It's very rewarding. We see a community of women rising up and empowering themselves. I've been working with Green Bioenergy for five years. I need us to produce more and more so that the company can develop and we get some other more customers, more than the ones we have. <laughs>